Hey, what's up everyone? This is Easy Speeds and Feeds. In this video, I'll show you how to do a stock model. So, here's the part. And we want to create a stock model so we can verify all of our toolpaths. So, we want to select this boundary that we made. We want to move it to its own level. model of the stock. Now we'll select that level, deselect the other ones, and we'll extrude out a block that we're going to use as our stock model. So 1.5. We'll go to toolpaths, right click, go to mill toolpaths, and go down to stock model. Go up to model, drag and select all, your entire piece of stock, click the check, move that towards the top of our operation, make sure stock model is on, and now We can select everything and verify it. So it's using what we created as stock and we can compare it against the model to see if our tool paths are cleaning up everything. So again, all you do is create your own level, extrude out a block that looks like the stock you have, go to mill toolpaths, go to stock model, go in the parameters, click on model, and select what you made and use it as a stock model. And then you can verify with it. That was our simple little video on how to create a stock model. Comment if you have any questions and uh, we'll see you later. Thanks.